Today I'm making a video on how to use the Nevco system for scoring games in the big gyms. So first of all, you can see I've got to plug in my battery because without the battery, it's not going to run. I'm sorry that the visual is going to be kind of ugly here for a minute. There we go. So that's all plugged in. Now it's as easy as turning it on, which is found on the side. You'll see the lights come on here and in a few seconds, you'll see the lights come on up on the board once the connection is made. There it is. Okay. So let's go through a couple of simple things. First of all, you'll notice the keys are on the board. There's numbered keys and there's keys that tell you what to do. So for example, right now I have to set the time. So I'm going to go set time. And then if I want to put in whatever I want to put in, let's say I want to put eight minutes, I'd put eight, zero, 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 zero. There you go. And you press yes and you'll see eight minutes comes up on the board, okay? Let's say you want to put in your score. The first time you put in your score, you go set, and let's say it was the home score. So you come over here to the home score key, and you go, yep, home score, and you'd press two, and then you'd press yes. And you'll see that the two appears on the board. Now, after you do that once, all you have to do for every time the home score scores after that is just go, home score, let's say they scored a single point, you go that, and you say yes, and you look up on there, and now it's added to three. So for the guest score, the very first time you do the guest score, you have to press set, come over to the guest score, press guest score, type in your number, let's say they scored a three right away, and then you press yes, and now you can see it's up on the board, it's a tie game. Okay, pretty simple. So if you wanna put in fouls or things like that, you would go set team fouls. Let's say they got two, one team foul, one, and then yes. And you'll see the team fouls show up on the board. Okay, so pretty simple like that. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to put the names in on the board. So for putting the names in the board, you have to go to the options button. And you click on the options button, you'll see, and you keep clicking until you see team names. And then you would say yes. So the guest team name, you'd say yes. Now, if you look on the board, you'll see that there's little number, little letters that correspond with the numbers and on here. 